Hello everybody, welcome in to this new video. I'm going to show you how you can import an image so we can use that for inspiration into the this code. So uh, in order to get started, what you want to do, of course, is to actually hit into the plus button, hit into upload a file. And here, what I want to do is to choose the image that I want to upload. In my case, I want to focus only into this one and hit into open. So as you can see, here's my image already uploaded. This is a preview. You want to hit into the enter mark. And just like that, my image is going to be already imported. So here, as you can see, we have the image. Now, if I want to use this image to create some great prompt, what I do want to do is to hit into the slash of the fast forward, choose imagine. And here into prompt, what I want to do is to first of all click into my image that was uh, imported right click copy image address if I paste this into this prompt here as you can see is the image that was cre created so before you tap into the answer what you want to do is to whether you want to choose a prompt before or after the image let's say for example make um variations of this image and you select the image and then later in the latest part we have the width and the height so i want to delete this one until it says png and here i want to delete this hit into the enter mark and the computer is going to be doing the work for you now in the end, it's going to be creating something like this. As you can see, we do have different variations of the image. So after that, you uh, whether you wanted to choose like U stands for upscale, so you can upscale image number one, image number two, three or four, or make variations of the corresponding images based on what you wanted to. In my case, I upscale the image number three, which is actually this one, and voila, this is my image upscaled. So there you have it guys, hopefully this was a very useful video for you. Don't forget to like and subscribe to the channel if you want to see more amazing tools about the Metajourney uh, application. Thank you once again for watching the video and I'll see you very very soon.